Greetings. Hope you all would be making these lamps and as Diwali is approaching near, your home must be sparkling with your self-made mathematical lamps. Today we are going to make fifth lamp in this series which will look like this. Its name is Icosa Hedron. For making this lamp, download the PDF whose link is in description box and make 10 copies of that. Such a beautiful lamp is created. The match behind this lamp is as beautiful as this lamp. This lamp is made of 20 triangular faces. That's why it is icosahedron. Icosa means 20 and hedron means faces. On each vertex, five equilateral triangles meet. Before this, we made another lamp called tetrahedron in which three equilateral triangles were meeting. In octahedron, four equilateral triangles were meeting. Today, the icosahedron that we made, five equilateral triangles are meeting. Now, if we add one more triangle here, that is six triangles at each vertex, then this structure would be flat. This is because this is angle of 60 degrees. And if we do six times 60, it is 360 degrees. So this structure would become flat here. Now, if we join the midpoints of icosahedron, we'll get dodecahedron. The outer one is icosahedron and here we have joined the midpoints of its faces and got dodecahedron in it. These are dual structures here which we talked about in our previous episodes. Another amazing fact is that if we join these two vertices with other two vertices then we'll get a rectangle. The rectangle will be in golden ratio. In cube also we saw that the rectangles were in the ratio of 1 is to root 2. And the rectangles and icosahedron are also in golden ratio. Here you can see three rectangles, red, yellow and blue. So if we join all the vertices of all the rectangles, we will get an icosahedron. So in this outer structure, you can see the icosahedron. Another interesting problem that we may think is, if we have to cover all the vertices without repeating the path, then which path should be chosen? This path is called Hamilton path. So, from this icosahedron, many interesting shapes can be obtained. The football that you play with is made of icosahedron. When we cut its length into 1 by 3rd, then shapes obtained will be pentagon and hexagon. That is our football. The geodesic domes also have icosahedron as the basic structure. In our lab also, we have made 5 feet, 10 feet and 25 feet geodesic domes.